Hey, what's up? Okay, let's talk about Lincoln Memorial Sand or Lincoln Penny. Okay, the year 2001. No mint mark. I have some information here. Okay, I will read the information. The information I got. Okay. Here we go. 2001 penny volume, no mint mark. The 2001 Lincoln penny was struck at the Philadelphia Mint. It does, then, does not contain any mint stamp under the date. These mint stamp, known as mint marks, are placed on some US coins to indicate which mint produced the coin. However, the Philadelphia was the location of the original United States Mint, which did not place its mint mark on many coins. Such is the case with most Lincoln cents from the Philadelphia Mint. So, if you come across a 2001 penny with no mint mark, it's a common coin from the Philly Mint. It is not necessarily special or valuable in and of itself. The reason the 2001 no mint mark penny is considered a common coin is because the Philadelphia Mint made a lot of 2001 pennies, nearly 5 billion to be exact. The Philly Mint struck 4 billion 959 million 600 thousand pennies in 2001, and there are still plenty to go around. Since the 2001 penny without a mint mark is so common, worn examples like might find in your spare chains or coin jar are worth only page value, just one cent. But that doesn't mean there aren't some rare and valuable 2001 pennies worth looking for. As you see below, there are some serious 21 penny errors out there. There are also uncirculated, never used as money, 2001 pennies that are worth more than pays value. A typical uncirculated no mint mark 2001 penny is worth about 10 to 30 cents. One of the more one of the nicest 2001 pennies without a mint mark ever sold pays on us. Tounding. $329 in 2016 that was for a specimen graded MS69RD by Professional Coin Grading Service. Okay, that's all. 2001 penny without a mint mark, $329. Okay, I hope I was able to provide some information for coin collecting. Bye for now. And... Have a great day.